welcome back with another room review uh, finally we have something uh, new a bit different which is android 10 now 2022 that means 2022 and we are using android 10 with latest security update so this is really cool and the drum name maybe some of you guys already know about that and which is casa i guess let me show you from about section the room name and which is android 10 as well and casa version 2.1 which is great and currently use lineage os plus that's why it's more stable and maintainer name is here really thanks to the developer for building this one and security update is very latest so as it is android 10 so you guys will get stable performance no problem with customizations and performance let's check out what's new and this is vanilla build so that's why you guys need to install gf separately just download kneecaps android 10 and install which will be core version of course then you will get more stable performance then we have other things like security which we have everything fingerprint app lock and of course a hidden application feature also available no problem with that then we have the privacy settings and storage as usual and sound and vibration as it is android 10 so you guys will get the user interface as like android 10 and i hope in uh, 2022 still some of you guys are uh, liking the android 10 and as it is stable and we have the final official android version 10 from ui and so that's why it would be very very stable now let's check some other things uh, like display settings but we have some uh, latest features like it's a color collaboration and other things as usual we had it before and picture adjustment as well a live display actually we have all necessary features run rotation settings then maybe screen saver and double tap to wake sleep wake on plaque and game driver preferences is available as well and we have the smallest width and here you guys can change the accent color as well and also change uh, some fonts like we have device default and other three then we have icon shapes you guys can change as well then we have the battery setting as usual just like android 10 but we have some uh, specific things like battery temperature and cycles completed current battery capacity which is important thing then we have other things like uh, apps and notifications and connected devices and keep casa that means the customization hub you guys will get status bar traffic indicator everything is working fine here you guys can see on the top of the status bar then we have the ticker notification ticker as usual and we have the status bar lyric if you want to enable that feature then we have system icons signal icons can be changed voldy wi-fi override and 4g and show activity indicators then we have colored status bar notification and clock style and clock and date setting as well then we have the quick settings brightness slider show always and where you want to show then we have the qs drag handle and qs footer text customize footer text as well and setting icon and edit icons and color notification then we have use customization here as well title visibility which you want you guys can do as a rows columns you guys can customize and style flip and duration uh, can be fast slow default and interpolator also there and which is just like that i'm using here now flip that's why it's flipping now let's talk about the buttons you guys already know system navigation as usual and we have other things here like a wake device and control playback and reorient and show app volume if you want to set it show app volume in volume panel just like then we have the gesture as usual a screenshot three uh, three finger swipe a screenshot and lock screen uh, every possible customization is here then we have the animations if you want to disable transition animations maybe in future updates we will get uh, more features here and we have then have battery and battery styles it can be selected just like android 12 l android 13 we have so many features and battery percentage 
where you want to show and battery styles and battery location and battery estimates everything is there then we have the miscellaneous and screenshot sounds and other things and suspend actions adaptive playback and gaming mode can be selected just like this and you can add game here and I play Call of Duty sorry uh, PUBG Mobile and unlimited Google Photos storage and unlock higher FPS in game unlock higher FPS in games is not working in uh, PUBG Mobile I played but we don't need anything in high FPS things but you can easily play games without anything because gaming experience just was great it was really great and as it is android 10 so smoothness is just mind-blowing and if you are using uh, a 2gb variant device then of course this is really recommended for you if you have 2gb ram in your device then of course you can go uh, with that rom which is really really literally very fast and accurate and smoothness just mind-blowing so let me talk about that the smoothness and the ram management and everything is just just great and smoothness just just awesome if you uh, want to use this pretty skin and kill and freeform whatever you guys can do as well and the ram management is perfect and battery backup is i still found really really great as it is android 10 so you guys will get a really better battery backup compared to android 11 12 and 12.1 and 13 as well so i'm uh, already rooted my device i so here you guys can see i'm using the safety net checker and safety net by default pass you guys can easily use any banking application and i don't want to waste your time by showing geekbench score and other things now let's talk about the default launcher which is a shady launcher and you guys will get some customizations and we have gestures and icons icon size and grid options and let's talk about the add drawer and hidden application feature as well if you want to hide application also you can do that and shady launcher is always just awesome and at a glance some features are available like this and you guys can see on the top uh, uh, in the border just a date and time is in a border just like Corbus OS and Corbus OS uh, latest update has been available um, I will provide the video soon so stay tuned for that and here you guys can see I'm using 8.4 Google camera you guys can easily use that Google camera in Android 10 as well without any issue everything is perfectly working I check nice side portrait and video everything is fine just you guys can install and use I already provided that Gcam which is Shamim Gcam you guys can check out description for that Gcam as well and I hope you guys like my work if you like my work then do subscribe and hit the bell icon and if you uh, need to know anything just let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching